Hello everyone and welcome back to FM Scout today. This is Jamie speaking and today I'm going to take some time to show you how to install user created tactics into your FM18 save. But before we get into today's video regarding installation of tactics guys, I just want to point you in the direction of my channel. I'll leave a link to it in the description down below. You can see here that I've got some FM18 content on there. Currently doing a FM18 beta save with AC Milan. The Rossoneri Rampage, we're currently into the third episode of that. It's probably going to be a couple more by the time this video goes live. We're also taking a look at the top English youth prospects, the top Italian youth prospects, which we're going to be following up in the near future. And I've also done a little FM18 predict series. And if any of you guys are interested in cricket, there's a bit of cricket captain as well going on there. 27 episodes of Rebuilding West Indies. So yeah, guys, I hope you like the channel. Remember to leave a like on any of the videos that you might like and subscribe to the channel if you're interested in seeing more content from me. But let's get back onto this FM18 FM Scout video regarding installing tactics. Now we're going to start off by downloading the tactics. Now, first of all, we're on the FM Scout website. So we're going to go across to the tactics screen. We're going to go to latest tactics. And here we can see a list of tactics which have been added for FM18. Now we're going to go with Jamie from FM Scout's Strikerless Destroyer 5230. And we're going to download that now. Okay then guys, so now that we have downloaded the tactic onto our hard drives, I'm going to show you the next step now, which is going to be, we're going to get the tactic here. You can see in the bottom left hand corner of the screen, and you can see here that we've got the FM18 tactic folder open. Now on my computer, it's in the C drive, documents, sports interactive, Football Manager 2018 tactics. Now what we're going to do is we're going to click on the FM Scout Strikerless tactic here. We're then going to copy it across into the folder. We can see here that it's now appeared in the tactics folder for Football Manager 2018. So we've been on the FM Scout website. We've downloaded the tactic which we require. We've moved it into the correct folder. Next, we're going to load up Football Manager 2018 and we're going to see how we get it imported into the game. So join me in a second and we're going to show you that part. Okay then guys, welcome back. We're now on Football Manager 2018. So we've navigated across to the tactics screen as you can see in front of us now. And we can see here that I've customly selected the 352 tactic here just for this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click the downward arrow. We're gonna click on load. We're gonna go into the folder, which you can see here is we want the FM Scout Strikerless Shadows formation. Press load and the tactic is now in your slots. Now I've seen a few people on social media and forums also inquiring about how to get more tactics into your game. And all you simply do is you click next arrow down where it's got none click on the down arrow and then you set to formation you can either set to a custom made formation or there or you can go into load again and you can select the same tactic on three different occasions and all this does is it just helps your team learn the tactic faster you can also put in different tactics if you wish if you wish to have a separate set of tactics where they can learn each one individually on a slower basis I personally like to have the same tactic in three times because it helps the team get more fluent with it and more familiar a lot quicker. So yeah guys, I hope you've enjoyed this little short snippet video today helping you install the custom made tactics that are up on the FM Scout website. If you've enjoyed today's episode guys, remember to please leave a like on the video down below. Subscribe to the FM Scout channel for more great FM18 content and I'll catch you again in the next video.